Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you how to draw a tree frog. So to begin with our tree frog, we want to start with the eye. So starting right here, I'm just going to draw a circle for the eye. Then right around the top of the circle, I'm going to draw a little curved line. And then I'm going to make a little curved line around the bottom. Then starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that goes up and then down to show where the other eye is. And then I'm going to put a little curved line to show where the pupil is, or the actual part of the eye. Then starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that goes out a little bit and then down. And then I'm going to just bring this line all the way around up here. Then starting right here, I'm going to draw a real thin little line to show where the lip is. And then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that goes down and then it's going to slowly come back up and go right to about here. Then I'm going to draw a little circle for the nose and put a little curved line above it. Then starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves back. Now, starting right here where we made this curve, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start here and I'm going to just draw a line that goes up to right about here. Then, sorry for all the noise, I've got cats playing in the background. So then, starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that just goes up and then down for the elbow. And then I'm going to draw a line here that just kind of curves down for the other part of the arm. Now for the hand. So I'm going to start by drawing a line that goes out, and then I'm going to put a little circle on the end and bring it back. Then I'm going to do the same thing here, draw a line down, a little circle, bring it back up. Then a line down, a little circle, and then bring it back. And then inside each of here, I'm going to put a little curved line for some webbing. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that goes right down here for the belly of the frog. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves down like this. And then I'm going to draw a line here that just kind of curves down. And then I'm going to make those same type of feet. So I'm going to make a line with a little circle at the end line with a circle, and then line with a circle, and bring it back up here. Then I'm going to put that little webbing in between there. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves down for a little bit more of the back. And then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that goes up and then it's going to curve back down for the back leg. Then I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves up like this. And then starting here, I'm just going to draw a line that kind of curves down. Then I'm going to do the same thing on the feet, but this time I'm going to kind of put them off to the side here. And then add your little webbing. And then starting right here by the, the arm, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of goes out and then down. Draw a little curved line that goes up here. And then a little line down right to about there. 
And then I'm going to leave this one right, just kind of empty here because I'm going to have the foot on the other side. So now, just for a few little details on the frog, I'm going to add a little circle that's not completely closed in for his ear. Going to add a couple little just kind of extra lines around his body. Bring this line in a little bit. Now the pupils on these tree frogs are almost kind of like a snake, so it's going to be long and skinny like this. I'm going to draw a little line right here just to kind of show where the color is going to change. Add some more little extra lines around here. And then finally for the tree branch. So I'm going to start right here, and I'm just going to kind of draw like a wavy line like this. I'm going to bring it up to the belly of the frog. And then I'm just going to kind of line it up, bring it up here. Then I'll start right here at this foot and just kind of draw the line down. And then draw it up. And then just to make some little texture on here, I'm just going to draw some long broken lines and different patterns on here. And this just kind of makes it look like some tree bark. I'm going to add some little spiral lines just for some little knots in the wood. And just kind of do this all the way along. You can even add some on the edges here. And there you go. There's your drawing of a tree frog. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.